It's time for food to go, and if you're craving some Cuban cuisine, we've got you covered. Joining us with all the details is Phoebe Benitez and Giovanna Calderon of Guaya. Thank you for Hi, having guys. us. Aloha, good morning. Thanks Aloha. for coming on today. I'm very excited about this and <laughs> to try some Cubanos. But just to start us off, for the viewers who don't know, what is a Cubano? Yeah, so a Cuban sandwich is essentially Cuban bread, mustard, ham, lechon, and then you have Swiss cheese. That looks so good. And we have a nice zoom in there on the screen. You also have a little bit of some dip. Yeah, too? so this is our house sauce, our guaya sauce. sauce. Yeah. It was originally created for our empanadas. That's originally what we started um, the company off of, and then the sandwiches just kind of took over. Awesome, and speaking of that, you also offer other things on your menu besides the Cubanos, you mentioned empanadas. Anything else you offer too? We also have our Cuban coffee, so it's traditional Cuban coffee. It's very strong and sweet. It's mm -hmm. espresso with sugar. Don't let the size fool you. <laughs> I know, I was gonna say, I'm like, I wanna kinda like double fist and be like, Cubano <laughs> coffee. It's a little bit early for a sandwich. I'm definitely gonna try it during the break though and right after the show, that's usually when we chow down on some food. But I do wanna try your espresso. And while I try that, tell me maybe there's a couple things that are unique about uh, guaya, is how you say it? It's guaya, guaya so, okay. no, guaya. no, you're fine. So guaya, it, it, um, it derives from the word guayaba, which in mm -hmm. Spanish means guava. Mm -hmm. And it, I kind of took it from the word, um, which... <laughs> yeah, this is, is so good because I was like, before, the, before we did our segment, I was like, you know what, sometimes I'm not an espresso person, but I'm really down to it's try. It's strong. Because it looks good. And it's strong, but sweet. So I strong love it because I'm a big, like I was telling you earlier, latte frappuccino girl. This is so good. I'm sorry, continue. No, no, it's okay. I was just like, so oh. the word guava, pretty much I took guaya from um, guayabera, which in Spanish are the traditional... Cuban shirts. So when the Cuban men were in the fields, they are picking the guavas and there's pockets on the shirts and they place the guavas in the pockets. Wow. So that's kind of a little backstory on where that came from. That's so cool. Awesome. And fun facts too. Great to know. Thank you. Where can we find your boots in? Because you do have some pop-ups. Yes. Yes, we do. So um, every Saturday you can find us at the Kaka'ako Farmer's Market from 8 to 12 and uh, we're on the Makai side. Oh, awesome. Yeah. And we're always open for pop-ups. We do those as well. Oh, awesome. Yes. Anything else that we need to know? Any future plans that you have for your business also? Um, right now we're just focused on perfecting our sandwiches right now and our Cuban coffee. We are still accepting pre-orders for our baked empanadas. Mm -hmm and our green sauce and our baked empanadas. We have a couple flavors. We have traditional picadillo, which is beef, ham and cheese, and guava and cheese. Mm -hmm. And then we do have seasonal flavors. That sounds yeah. amazing. They look great. I know they're gonna taste great. I'm gonna try a couple of these after Thank the you. break. <laughs> but to close us off, tell us then where we can find more information on you guys, maybe Instagram, website, if you have it, so that people can follow along on your journey and then find your future pop-up schedule. Yeah. For sure. Um, I would definitely recommend our Instagram is our best point of contact. It's guaya.emp. Um, and then as well as our email, guaya.emp at gmail.com. Perfect. And we have that on the screen. Your Instagram looks awesome. I know this is going to taste amazing too. And we're definitely going to have this up on the website later so that you guys can find the interview. And then also during our 8 a.m. hour too. So this is going to be Thank awesome. you. Thank you ladies Thank you so much. Thank you for having us. Thank you.